Howdy folks, got another product for you today, it's from Extra Decals, it's decals for um, Hawker Hurricane Mark 1. Um, we apologise if it's a little bit of rough noise in the background, uh, it's raining outside, It's we've had sun for the last two weeks and now we've finally had a bit of rain. Um, and it's been raining pretty much all day, nasty. Uh, anyway, so uh, kit number X4814. Double four, and so it's for the Hurricane Mark One. It's a set of decals. You get five or six options inside, um, and there's your decals. So we we'll take a closer look at these. There's your set of decals. Um, and the ones at the bottom with the roundels. Mm, nice name, colour and register. And as I say, you get um, six options, five or six options. But you can only do two out of the uh, five or six, and you can only do two. Uh, you get this nice piece of paper on the back, it tells you all the uh, colours. So, Royal Air Force colours all the way down, the US colours, and the German colours, which is a nice touch. Um, and it tells you the, the code numbers to the colours, um, which is really, which is a nice touch. Uh, this is the option sheet for the decals. The first one, first hurricane is um, eighty-seven squadron, based at Dover. August 1940 um, Lieutenant Ian I'm not going to pronounce the rest of his name because I can't uh, aircraft number P2798 a little note here not too sure about the red nose if it was bright red or dull red all the reference I've looked at everyone seems to use bright red um, second aircraft um, squadron 145 based at Surrey, UK, June 1940 um, flown by CEO in other words I don't know what, what, who that is I know what CEO is but it's unknown um, third hurricane the famous 303 squadron, Polish Air Force, not Polish Air Force, but Polish squadron. <coughs> um, aircraft V6665, serial number RFJ, um, flown by Lieutenant J.E. Kent. Uh, if you wish to look him up, <coughs> he's, I think he was the uh, one of the leaders of 303. He's very famous, uh, based at Kent as well, September 1940. What I like about this is the stripe again. Um, they're not too sure about the stripe, if the stripe was red or bright, or, or if the stripe was dull red. Um, but what I say, all the reference photographs I've looked at for that, everyone's used bright red. The same as the, uh, same kind of red as uh, what's on the uh, flag. Another hurricane, um, Canadian um, pilot, um, Squadron 242, aircraft V7467, um, aircraft LED.
July 1940, where you get one that's based at Duxford. Um, aircraft P3148, Squadron NNQ, uh, Squadron 3010. It's the um, I'll say it's based at Duxford, 1940, September 1940. Um, so I'm possibly going to be doing this one. And possibly doing this one. If I don't do this one, I'll be doing the 303 for sure. Um, so. so there you go, guys. There's the options you can do. And these options, this is again top colours. The, um, anyone wondering what that colour is here? The P B S three eight one L A do now. I think that's how you pronounce it. That colour is sky. It's the colour known as sky grey or sky, which is R R S sky. Um, which is. Um, this colour here, which is a uh, green, um, uh, and if you if you're wondering what it looks like on an aircraft, I've used it already. That aircraft up there with the D-Day stripes is my, I always get this mixed up, it's either a Hellcat, I think it's a Hellcat, um, or Bearcat, it's one of those, but I always get it mixed up between this one and this one, I've always get, I always get them two planes mixed up, one's a Hellcat and one's a Bearcat, and I always get it mixed up, but anyway, that green colour on that aircraft is that same colour, which is that. Um, and a D null colour. Um, it took me a while to uh, get it referenced. Strangely enough, I would have thought it was on this card, but it's not. But they do have the RS Sky, which is this one, um, which is also known as Duck Egg Green. Um, this the um, so that's what it was. Um, but if you wish to do the other colours down the bottom, the underside is a Sky Type S, which is this one here. Uh, no, not that one. This this one here. I have it here, um, and it's it's more. How can I pronounce it? It's more on the uh, beigey green colour. It's more not not so no. It's not so green. It's more. More of a uh, browny, beigey, greeny colour. It's not. It's a slightly different shade. Um, as I say, there you go, guys. There's the decals again. Done by extra decals. Ladies. <laughs>